show anyone your hoo -ha. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. <sighs> Welcome to my new bedroom. Well, it's not really a new bedroom, but we did get a new headboard, bed, mattress, all that good stuff. Okay. <laughs> Uh, okay, so let's just move right into this. I kind of wanted to film this video with Nick because bless his soul, I love him so much, but I'm just not down with the way he wanted to name our kids. So we'll get more into that. I'm gonna pull up our name list. And there are a couple that I'm just not gonna share, period, because they're literally already planned for the other children that we're going to have. <laughs> but I think there's only one on here that I'm not going to share. Hello. What do you think of the new bed, Joseph? Jojo's. Hi, cutie. What? Trying to hustle me for some freaking wet food right now. Go do your job. Go handle the rodents in the garage. Alrighty, so I have this giant list that I don't know if you can see and I shared it with Nick and I had him put a like hang loose, well that was his choice, I was like thumbs up the ones that you like, you know, and you're good with. And we've had this list going since before I had um, a miscarriage and all of that, so we've had this going for quite a while. So he went in and added a hang loose emoji to all the ones that he was into and then we finally had to have a discussion about this because I was like, okay look, I don't know how like your brain works, but like, we don't like the same names. We don't like the same TV shows. It's a whole thing. It got really hot in here in this fleece rope. <laughs> I'm gonna try not to show you guys my snatch too, cause I don't have anything on under this. Um, cause I was rubbing oil all over my body, which I do like four times a day these days. So when I had this conversation with Nick about names, he told me that he really likes names to mean something. He likes names that are like, a relative's name or someone important to you and it, it means something. I am literally the complete opposite. I could care less what a name means in terms of like the actual definition of it or if it was someone's that I care about. Like, I don't care about that. I just want a cute name. So this was a little hard because he was like, oh, how about your grandma's name, Patricia? And I was like, I cannot imagine naming a baby Patricia. Like, no offense, grandma, I love you. Your name fits you for your um, the year you were born, but no. Then we had, we, so we had to go back and forth basically. And I really like names that kind of could work for a boy or a girl and He's on board with that too. Yay, we gotta win, we agree on something. So I'm just gonna go through the list that we have going here. And like I said, I'm gonna take out a like just two, two of them, just two, okay? Because they're going to be my future children's name. Uh, and I'll leave one in here actually that might be two, but here we go. This is gonna, this is a long list, so I'm kinda just gonna read them off. Um, we've got Lyric, Dutch, Hazley, Imogen, Indio, Cadence. That was like one of my favorite names like a while ago. I wanna say like a decade ago, I was obsessed with uh, the name Cadence. Uh, River, Wolf, Wednesday Marie, Harper, Apollo, Nova, which one of my friends actually just named her daughter Nova and I didn't know that until I put it on here. So I'm wondering if I like subconsciously knew but didn't know, do you know what I mean? Hallie not to be confused with Haley, Alaric, Jack. Okay, these are the ones that Nick thumbsed up. Jack, Sunny, Bodie, Riker, I was shocked on that one because it's a little different, Paisley and Holland. So Nick really likes like Jack and like just simple, simple names. And I just didn't want to be that mom that like, no offense if that is your child's name. But for me personally, I just know so many Jacks and I was just like, there are enough on the planet. So let's, let's try and think outside the box a little bit. Uh, and that is all that he thumbs up. So I'll continue with some of the ones that I came up with. Uh, Rini, um, Camry, Parker, Phoenix, Kingston. I actually knew somebody named Kingston a while ago and Holland, um, Sadie, Porter, Porter is like such a cute name for like a dog too. I just love that. Asher, uh, Jack is on here twice. Ellis, Kai, 
Waverly, Arison, did I already say that one? Nix, N-I-X. That was Nick's idea. And I was just like, that would be so confusing. Okay. Like just so confusing. Um, Cameron, Tennessee, Montana. I was on a theme there. If you can tell, uh, <laughs> Remy, uh, Booker, Jet, Hendrix, Bo Bennett, uh, Benson, Asher James. I think I had Asher up there, but I didn't have the middle name. Oakland Renegade and call uh, them Ren for short. Briar, Knox, Oakley, and then the last one I can't share because I'm pretty sure that's going to be the next child's name. So that is my list of names. I will put that in the description box as well, but I'm curious like what your guys thoughts are. Are you the type of person that shares your like names that you want to name? Like you, when you're pregnant, people always ask you, well, can I ask you like what the name's going to be? And people are kind of weird about it. Cause like they're weird about it, <laughs> you know? So I'm just curious, like, let me into your brain. Like, do you guys feel like sharing your name with everyone works or has someone stolen your name before? Um, I asked this question in a previous video a while ago and I loved reading your answers because you guys had like some really fun stories about like supporting both sides. So anyways, I'm curious, do you share your name? Do you keep it a secret? What do you do? Um, yeah, so that's it. Those are the names and it's like an ever growing list. So if you think of any cool names that you think I should add to my list for the future, drop them down below and I will add them and we will take those into consideration. Joseph, hey, don't ignore me. JoJo's. Did your cat just f***ing ignore you too? Like, but then doesn't want to be touched at all? Hey, you're on my bed. Oh, yes. Oh, kitty kitty. Oh, get a little booty up. <laughs> All right, guys, thanks for watching. We will see you in the next video. I can't wait to read your comments.